Hello everybody and welcome back to Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic. It's been a while since I posted a video. Once again for the thousandth time I apologize for that. It's been a little bit of a crazy week. So anyway, I hope you guys are all doing safe, or being safe and doing well. And uh, the video will start in a second. Oh dang. Oh Larry, thank you for the, thank you for the host Larry. I appreciate it. I was like, what's going on? We got they freaking respawned the rancors again. That's not fair. Um That didn't do anything. Cool. people started protesting outside doctor's offices because they were sick and wanted a cure instead of going into quarantine. Holy cow. There's There's been several instances, I think, in pop culture of, like, like sort of tongue-in-cheek. Like, oh, yeah, people would totally act like this, you know. Or, but they act like, like attempts at being satirical, but I think they were actually not really satirical. It was just like, no, this is what would happen. Like, this is what would happen. in this situation. I am gonna see really quick if I can actually just walk up to the temple and go in. Maybe a memory will come back. Oh yeah, the World of Warcraft. I mean, that the World of Warcraft outbreak was like used in like actual like scientific studies and everything. Like of how people would react to plagues and stuff. I will probably need to do this. What does the adhesive grenade even do? been in there I was like whoa and I was like tell me about it and you're like there were a lot of dead bodies and I was like that's not fun. oh crap oh crap all right well at least I got that yeah okay what this is what I knew that'll see. show you Wow, Anderus takes damage like a champ. How does he do that? How does he do it? He's freaking amazing. <laughs> the wow outbreak oh you should look it up it was it was actually really fascinating how, it, how it happened and everything no it was a debuff that players yeah it was supposed to be in a dungeon because of a bug what happened is that when, when people left the dungeon the bug was supposed to or the, the debuff was supposed to go away like it wasn't supposed to like be a problem in the like only in the dungeon but what happened is people's pets could catch it too and the code hadn't taken into account that people like like hadn't hadn't, hadn't taken into account that it needed to take the, the debuff away from pets so people would like bring their pets into a fight right and then they would leave like they, they, they would they would bring their they would like put their pets back into like their pockets or whatever 
you know, like like unequip their pet, and then they would bring it back out in like the wider world of WoW, and they uh, the pets started spreading it to players, and then the players would start spreading it to the players, and it was like, this is a giant mess. Yeah, I mean, it did, it did, uh, weeding out the casuals from the real players. Yeah, weak players who didn't have, like, a lot of health, they would, and, and the thing is, like, they were dying so fast that they, uh, like, literally, they, 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 they would try, they would die, respawn, and die again. They just kept dying over and over and over again, and so they couldn't, they couldn't even leave the area, you know? It's actually, it was really interesting. And, like, there was, like, a, a citizen, like, a citizen, like, coalition formed, like, that would put up, like, blockades. Like, 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 players would stand in front of infected areas, keeping other players away, you know? And, like, high health, like, like high level players who had, like, a lot of health and, like, armor and, like, helps against, like, the debuff would go in and, like, attempt to try to figure out, like, like, clues and, like, stuff that had happened and stuff and, like, then there were healers, like, like, people who, like, specced as healers would, like, come en masse and, like, try to heal people enough that they could get out, you know? And, um, like, because you had to keep spamming heals on them otherwise they wouldn't be able to make it out so it was pretty interesting but then there was also like the troll factor right where some people would intentionally get infected leave the area and if an area because like because like player because blizzard didn't do anything about it it was literally just a player driven initiatives that were trying to like cut down the infection rate and then when when the players would start to like you know when their when their protocols would start helping and like infection rate was slowing down these trolls would like come out of the mountain and and like or come out of wherever they were hiding and like reinfect people on purpose isn't that or like or there were people who just wanted to see they're like, oh, I want to see, and they were like tourists, like gawkers, right? So they would go into infected areas and take pictures of literally all, like, hundreds of dead bodies, like hundreds of player dead bodies laying in the, like laying on the ground. And then they would get infected and take it outside. So it was just a fascinating look at like what people are capable of for good and for evil. Blizzard was trying to figure out what the problem was. They didn't, they, they put up suggestions like, don't go into this area, blah, blah, blah. But they were spending the majority of their time trying to like find the actual bug that was causing the problem. They weren't putting, they weren't putting like, think like strictures into place to like limit people's interactions, you know? It was all done by like player initiative. Yeah, yeah, yeah. PVP was basically suicide bombing with the debuff, yeah. Yeah, yeah, it was cr it was crazy. Yeah, they had to like reset the entire server. And, like in the end, they couldn't they couldn't figure out. Like, they knew what the problem was, but they couldn't fix it. And what they had to do was just um, freaking like re reset the entire server. It was it was crazy. All right, dang it. I do re recommend looking it up. It's pretty cool. Like, not only, like, just, like, what happened on the ground, but the actual case study that studied it. Like, pretty interesting stuff. Oh, yeah, no, it's great how the players adjusted. It was, like, well, and, like, uh, the, the trolls were kind of obvious, right? Like, everybody knew that was going to happen. But, like, seeing how, like, guilds and players, like, banded together to try to prevent the spread of the plague was really fascinating. Okay, so I can't do anything here. I just tried to go in there and it won't let me. Um, I don't want to go to... I want to go to South Beach? Oh, eventually I want to go... No yes, I want to go to the Central Beach and go north again and talk to the other tribe. The other tribe's in the north. There's a world boss, but you could make him attack you and run, and he would follow. So, Gilda player decided to make a human chain of sacrifices to lead him into the main city of the game. 
What? What? Blizzard Jam had to force despawn him manually and give him a max. You. Why didn't they give him a max chase range anyway? That's like basic game dev. You don't like let your. Bo How do you let the boss get out of the dungeon? Uh, that just seems crazy. I mean, people, people will do, people will do crazy things, especially because online, like, uh, I think some people said that, like, the case study was really limited in, in its scope because people would not act like that in the real world like they wouldn't intentionally get sick and spread it to other people you know they wouldn't they wouldn't just walk into an area they weren't supposed to be in you know um Wait, what? Oh. Oh, crap. Crap. But yeah, no, the, the, the study was like people wouldn't intentionally go to places that they like just to look or like just to like go to it because the NPCs didn't die. And just to go to a shop or whatever. They're like, oh yeah, people wouldn't actually be that dumb in real life when real life and death was on the line. They'd only do that in a virtual environment where they can respawn, blah, blah, blah. The NPCs could die, the NPCs couldn't die. Oh, they'd respawn. That 300 players be coordinated enough to sacrifice themselves in a line efficiently enough to lead him anywhere. That's actually crazy. Like, a part of me is like, how dumb? And another part of me is like, wow. Like, if you could channel that level of coordination and effort into something decent in your life, like, gamers would be unstoppable. I had to wait hours in an infected area to sell stuff. Oh, geez, not even worth it. Um... Hang on. Isn't there... Uh, la, 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 la. Was there another way to enter this settlement? Because uh, if I'm just going to have to, like, freaking... Now I'm kind of confused. Like, how am I supposed to get the help of these guys? Like, I, it seemed like I had an option for it to be peaceful, but apparently not. <laughs> Everything, every month there's something was broken and hilariously killed everyone. That's, I mean, that's amazing. Blizzard was just like, yo, man, we did not expect this. The, the combined power of millions of players trying to break your game. You can't, you can't test for that, you know? Hmm. I just have to kill everybody to get in. Have we made you a neato hardcore boss? What's this? A new toy to create Armageddon? People, people, people are, people are amazing and terrible, but amazing. Oh my gosh, okay, hang on. I wanna go. Let's try this out. Beach. I think the South Beach is essentially a dead end. But I'll look. I'll just double check. Oh my gosh, Kander is! Hurry up, buddy. Come on. Uh, he's so slow. Why is he so slow?
Yep, it's a dead end. I don't want to have to kill everybody. I might try to sneak in if there's a back way. I'll try to sneak in. I think there's another path in the central beach. Ooh, let's see. Oh no, there is not. It's all right then. These are the only routes I know of is south, central, and north. So here we go. Time to try to destroy half an enclave worth of people. You guys were like, ah, oh, that's a lot of talking. And the game was like, yeah, it is a lot of talking. Here's an entire horde of people to kill. Oh, actually, real quick, let me repair my ship while I have the parts. We can't leave yet, because uh, the disruptor field hasn't been disabled, but. Who's, who are these ship parts? You may be able to repair the, um, me? Oh, God, is this, a, is this like a repair thing? Oh my gosh, is it, oh my gosh. Oh no. Oh, I did it. What? What, I didn't even have to roll for repair? Or maybe I did, but it was hidden? Oh, okay. Uh, all right, cool, cool beans. Easy. I'm actually a goddess at everything I try to do, ever. What? I'm a mechanic. I'm a Jedi. I'm... I'm unstoppable, really. It's one extreme to another with this game. It really is. Maybe they had something like prototyped, or, like you had to like do like a me game or something to fix it, and then they either didn't have the time to fully flesh it out, or people were just like, "This sucks." <laughs> I'm about a god. I know. And I can't help it. I always love that interaction. You just push him over. You're like, "Ding!" It's so funny. So freaking funny. Oh, and still. Did I go the right way? Yeah, I did. Hi, everybody. Mm hmm. Yep, 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 yep. Unskippable cutscenes! Okay, um, let's try. Holy moly! That was a it did a lot of people. Oh my gosh. Um let's try one more. Oh dang, no, they're dropping like flies. Whoa. Yeah, that's all you need to do is just friggin' heal everybody and I'll just firestorm the crap out of them. Uh, I didn't mean to do that. I didn't know why I was sitting around in circles. Wow, I have a literal mass of bodies here. Holy, holy, holy moly. Was actually crazy. I know, I know, right? The wow virus is here. Freaking look. All these bodies. War leader. Oh, I didn't talk to you last time. You think I can? Nope, I can't. Oh, my, my powers are really cool. Oh, 
Why are you guys why are you guys starting fights? This guy's gonna oh. take me out, like absolutely. <laughs> Bond yet? Okay. We're just gonna what? take forever to <laughs> to be able to heal mm. ourselves. Hmm? Close enough. Wow, virus. <laughs> I am a damage dealer, not a damage taker. All right, come on, please, come on, come on. Huh? Right. You're fine. Oh no. And you need? I need somebody to with like the ability to move. Hmm. Nope. All right then, we're just okie dokie. Um, let's try. It only lasts 10 seconds, but, or 20, sorry, but we'll see if, oh, dang. Let's do that. Ooh, nice. Very nice. I'm here. Ah! <laughs> This is what they get for talking too much, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> you no. There we go. No, you saved. Oh, but I still, I still, it still worked. Oh man, look at all that damage. Holy cow. So, nope. There's still somebody in the stick in front of us. Please don't put your weapons away. Oh wait, actually. Oh, I used up all my power. No. Good. Oh my gosh, are you serious? I hate that. Where like there's an attack that came before and I didn't realize it. Do I have enough yet to... Field's broken. I'm I'm literally massacring this entire building. It, it's really weird. I don't like it. I wanted to try to do Never it. Never too old for this! Apparently not. Apparently, they lied to me back at the camp when they suggested that I could potentially. Um. Oh, okay. When they, when they potentially suggested that I could find a peaceful way to resolve this. 
Instead, I'm a monster. Other way. Right, what? Okay. I'm a monster. I know, right? Freaking, I am, am I a good guy? I don't know. At this point. Die! I don't know how else I could have done it though. Like I have to come back here in order to like, try to do a peaceful solution. Oh! Maybe I didn't Die. earlier and didn't talk to the one I should have. I thought I explored everywhere though. Take that. Uh, oh well. <laughs> the next time you renegade in Mass Effect. I'm so unhappy. <laughs> that? You a hologram? You look hologrammy from here. Oh, you just weren't floating in. Intruder, don't get one of you. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. They opened the lever. Never too old for this. I still The what? Dang. Okay, well, this did not play out how I thought it would. Well, uh, I, don't I don't know. I don't know what else I could have done. I had limited, limited options. Let's see what you got. Oh, dang. I'm gonna die. Oh, 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 wow. We got mauled. And we're gonna cut it off there. I know it's kind of in the middle of the fight, but uh, you know, event we do succeed, and you'll see that in the next episode. So look forward to that. Um, the next episode will be a bit short, and this one was a little short too, just because it was just kind of an awkwardly timed uh, thing, like I don't know, series of events that happened. So anyway, thank you all again for being so patient and for still watching this, <laughs> despite me taking forever to finish it. But I do appreciate it a lot, like a lot, a lot. So I hope you all are being safe and doing well, and I will see you in the next one.